in this video, we'll do a quick overview of Schoology's Elementary View, a course setting that can be toggled on or off depending on your course needs. The biggest change when toggling on the elementary view happens to what the learners see. When learners open a course in Schoology that's been set to the elementary view, they see a different homepage for the course. Their options on the left side of the screen are simplified and course materials can be found under My Activities. One of the biggest changes in the elementary view is that each item, folder, page, or assignment can be tagged with a unique image. Course images can be customized so that they can help learners to navigate their materials easier. Learners will still be able to see what type of resource it is by looking at the icon on the right side of each course material. Let's take a look at what the assignment view looks like for a learner in the elementary view. When we click on the assignment, you'll be able to see all of the different pieces that normally would appear in an assignment, including audio attachments, links, and text. Underneath those main materials, you'll also see simplified course submission buttons that allow a learner to see visually their options for submitting to an assignment. Once a learner submits to an assignment, they'll be able to see their work and feedback under the My Work tab in the assignment. They can see their rubric score, comment with the teacher, and view multiple submissions. Materials other than assignments look very similar to what you've seen in the secondary view or default view of Schoology. So you can still use things like discussion boards, media albums, etc. just as you normally would. Now that we've looked at what the learners see, let's take a look at how the elementary view impacts the educator. Even with the elementary view toggled on, the educator view stays very much the same in Schoology, meaning you won't have to learn too many new details in order to manage your class. To toggle the elementary view on, select Course Options and select Edit Privacy Course Settings from the menu. Once in Course Settings, scroll all the way to the bottom and select Elementary as the course theme. Don't forget to save your changes. Once toggled on, everything that you create within your teacher view will stay the same, except that each type of material will now include the option to add a featured image. Featured images are what the learners will see as they access your materials. It's as easy as an upload in order to add a featured image Note that they must meet their file size requirements of less than five megabytes per file. You can create your own images using Canva or another creation place, or you can upload their use images. When preparing to give learners feedback, all you have to do is go to the submissions, just like you have in the past. As an educator, you'll still be able to give feedback and grade using rubrics or number percentages, just the way that you normally would have. Ready to get started? Reach out to your DLC with any additional questions you may have. 